Okay, guys. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Jonna, and I'm so happy you stopped by. If you're new here, leave me a comment so I can say hi to you. Welcome you to the channel. And if you're coming back for a visit, I would love to hear from you too. Now today, I'm going to do, I have a doctor's appointment at 2.30. So I am going to start out at 11 o'clock and do some DoorDash, Uber Eats, and Grubhub. At 11.45, I have a pickup for shipped, my first shipped. And uh, it's a small order. It's actually just four sets of sheets. So I'm going to go in and hopefully they have them and purchase that and then drop it off to the customer. Now shipped, I didn't know this week, they had 10 orders get an extra $100. Wow, that's a good bonus. So uh, right now they have 10 orders, get 10 extra dollars, which isn't a big deal. But I'm figuring over the weekend they know people can really achieve it. Maybe it's a midweek bonus they put out. So people will um, use the platform in the middle of the week. Okay, let's go. You, come on, come with me. It's going to be a bumpy ride. <laughs> okay, guys, I have my first shipped order, and I am actually at Target. So this is what it looks like. And I believe it was $9 pay for items. Okay, they're sheets. So they're all going to be in the same place. Hopefully they have four. Um, 32 minutes. I don't think it'll take that long unless I can't find them or they don't have them. Um, it's prepaid, but I do think I need to take my card. Um, I don't know exactly what it means, prepaid or not prepaid. And then I drop it off and the drop off is they say 10 minutes away so um yeah the total is 51 dollars the sale total so my payout is i believe nine expected yeah let's do this um uh, i have to drop it off between 12 and 1 i'm supposed to start shopping by 11 45 and it's 11 19 wanted to get here early. I didn't want to be on a dash and this is my first order so I'm kind of excited. Uh, tells me the section it's in. I need twin microfiber sheet set count of four. C7 section one, C2 section one, and C1 section one. So hopefully they have four sets. I know how it goes. Usually, I don't think they normally have that many. Well, I don't know. Maybe they do. Um, so, that is my shopping list. So, I'm going to send an intro text. Hi, Kenya. This is your ship shopper, Jonna. I'm about to begin shopping your order from Target. Please let me know if you need anything else. Okay, so I sent her a message. I'm going to take my cord. And I'm going to take my wallet. In my wallet, I actually have a backup battery. I'm going to check it because I haven't used it in a while. I use, whoops, I use this for Instacart because when I do Instacart, yeah, it's full. When I was doing Instacart a couple times, I was like losing battery life fast. And you have to do, you have to scan, you have to have your, your phone working. It's not like you can pick it up and get in the car and plug your phone in. You have to use your phone to pay. And um, so yeah, so you need battery. So I have my backup battery. have my backup battery and I'm ready to go in. Come on, come with me. Okay, first of all, that was like the easiest freaking thing I've ever had to do. To deliver, when you arrive you need to press the call button on the box 
in the gate, we'll, I will let you in if no answer. I'm not supposed to be there for 20 more minutes in early. So, um, I'm gonna let the car cool down a little bit and head on over there. Is there a Starbucks here? I think there was one in the store. Eleven minutes. I'm gonna start going. Okay, after that order, I got this Cold Stone Creamery order for seven dollars. update you a little bit. I went to the doctor today. I got some shots in my knees. Um, so I've been multi-apping and trying to, as I'm taking one, accept another. See if that works a little better. Since it's so slow, it it is. Um, I had a eight something from Payway for Uber Eats had a lucky wishbone. It was a nice uh, surprise. It was $9. So there was a hidden tip. It had said it was 7 It was 9 um, And that was going about three miles. Um, and then I had one for 7 that went about two miles. All easy drop-offs. Um, let's see what else I can get. I'm trying to multi-app, like layering it, if that makes sense. Like take an order as I'm on the way to drop it, except another one. I don't know if we're supposed to do that, but it's working out. I don't have any late orders, so I'm happy about that. Okay. I did want to mention something. I noticed that the times for the door dashes are really close. Like, they need to be delivered within 15 minutes. 10 or 15 minutes. This is telling me maybe they're not getting picked up in time. And they're a little pushed back. So, you know, with that said, maybe um, door dash will be a little bit easier on how they're hiding tips. <laughs> okay, let's go. Hey guys, that was $10. $7 tip. I, I think it only said $7. It might have said more, but it didn't say 10, so. There was a hidden tip there. Let's go. Keep this going. Okay guys, here are a couple more orders I had, $12.60 on an uber eats which was an increase on the original tipped amount and then here are some of my grubhub the base pay for grubhub is quite a bit higher than uber eats or doordash but i noticed a lot of the tips are, seem to be less not all of them but some of them